This is Philip Ditch from Beer Ambassador San Diego. Tonight we are at Little Miss Brewery Craft Beer on Park and Mark in the East Village. Tonight we're going to be trying out some uh, craft beer. Uh, we're going to try out the Devil's Piano and the POW. Also, they got some great food here, some good sushi. Shout out to Raw Power Sushi. Um, they know their stuff. Okay, let's come on in. So this is the Devil's Piano. It's kind of like a chocolate stout. Now, once you get it, you can smell it. It's like an almond chocolate taste. Pretty good. You can see that it's a... Uh, it's up there, it's like nine, it's like seven to nine point eight. Here's my specialty cherry purple heart. Purple heart floated over the cherry blister. I'm not gonna down this because I don't want to get too wasted. There's still more to go. But it's tart, it's really good. It smells really good. And I like it. I like every beer though. Every beer I like it. That's my motto. I'm sorry. I'm the beer ambassador of San Diego. Doing these reports on reviews of breweries. You can only be very serious as you're working. Right? A beer. Right. Oh yeah. That's sour taste. Bomb. System right here, I'm perfectly fine. So this is a random beer. No, I pay. As being a San Diego, what what makes you feel that? Well, first of all, I'm not San Diego. Oh, you're not. I'm in New Orleans. Oh, you're New Orleans. Okay. What I like the most about craft beer in San Diego is the variety and the complexity of the brews are so awesome. The beer here in this city is amazing. Nice, isn't it? It's the, just the variety that you can get at any given craft brewery in the town. It's great. Off the charts, right? You Off recommend, the fucking charts. You recommend this uh, craft. New Orleans, they got a lot of good beer around there. They got a lot of, you know, bars and all that. Okay, well, my 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 city. City. My, my, you tapped into it. You guys have fucking nailed it here. Like, it's fucking, you, you're getting it done. You're getting it done. From New Orleans. How oh, awesome is that? No. Okay, time out, time out. Come on. Drummer's getting this. What? How do you pronounce it properly? It, it's correctly pronounced Nolans. I knew it. Nolans, Louisiana. And we drink a lot of beer. That's what so, we like. So anything coming from me, giving props to another city about drinking, holds credit. Little Miss Brewery, Park and Market, East Village. I mean, it's great customer service. Vicky's taking care of us, and we're having a good time. All right, so we're right here in Little Miss Brewery, as you can see. Look at this. This is something that that draw me here. Half price until 7 p.m. daily. They got deals on beer on a daily. And then when I was telling Philip, hey, we need to record our second video here. I go on their website and I see Friday nights from 7 p.m. to close, and they close at 2. They give you a wristband for 20 bucks and it's bottomless drinks. Meaning that unlimited beer. Just control yourself because you will get kicked out if you can't, can't, you can't control yourself. Drink responsibly, guys. Don't ask for the rules. That's the rule. All right, so come here. Little Miss Brewery. Started with this girl, right? Then they were thinking of, well, what what else can work to fit the theme? What fits better than bombshells in San Diego? San Diego, puro San Diego. <laughs> Record these guys. No, that's part of the film. That's like get them in that 1940s. 
and that's how the in the miss if you record the miss in the miss it shows a bombshell and if you actually go inside on the tab they actually have copper bombshells and a little backstory on that is that copper bombshell is Do you actually have a history? yeah that story time that's <laughs> yay! <laughs> yay that's actually me <laughs> Focus! <laughs> okay. Focus! Okay. That, Focus! That copper is actually going back to Arizona, to Mexico. One of the owner's friends decided to, hey, you know what? I'm gonna make your, you know, I'm gonna make the little bombshells for your tap, for your handles on the tap beer. And that's how that happened. And now pretty much is the logo. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong. If you work here, you know, go ahead and put in the comments more details. This is the little information that I was able to gather. So, yeah, and then also, if you go to, they have multiple other, they have more than just one brewery in San Diego. So, if you go to the other other uh, breweries, you'll see that they have uh, a lot of World War II stuff. Brilliant. Yeah, there you go. And all that was donated by actual vets or people who had their hands on, you know, historic items from World War II. I, I and have a lot of stuff from Vietnam. Why would well, you have stuff from Vietnam? Well, there's a well, Vietnam you know, brewery. If there's a Vietnam brewery, you can go ahead and donate it to them so they can make Oh, yeah. No, I, I keep that. I keep it. Okay. Yeah. Well, what I was trying to say is a lot of people who love this, you know, this have company. passion for this little brewery and want to make it authentic, they donate their World War II goods. And this could be from museums. It. This can be from family. This can be from themselves. I mean, there's still people... Are rocking and rolling that actually yeah. fought. And they want to keep the air alive. Yep. So let's go back inside because I'm thirsty. Well, you know, I did the POW. That was good. And test, I want to do another another beer. I'm gonna go talk to Vicky, and we're gonna go. I will get you. You know what? Maybe we should do a flight. How about that? Let's do a flight. Let's do a flight. Okay, here we go. You get five. You get five. Okay. So here we go. Kill her. Remember, it's better than mine. I don't remember. It's, it it's nice and dark. It's a nice stout. Smells really good. I pre it. It is. I pre it. Because either I'm lazy. It's gonna get you there. Okay. She's here Saturday nights and Sunday mornings. That day at the beach? Uh, no. It's like. Episode two. That was good. You put the works. Having a good time. Come to Park and Market. I recommend this place. Little Miss Brewery. Get these great bartenders. Vicky. Sorry, production is about it. Mindy, right here. If you're in Mass San Diego, Park and Market. I know it's it's up and coming. Beckel Park. I know there's a lot of like. If you guys watch it before the before the season starts, get off of Park Market. Forget about the opening period. Yeah, yeah. Forget about the opening period. Too many people. Right here. Too many people over there. Oh, it's expensive, and it's not even like craft beer. It's just like ridiculous. Do not go get a Bud Light for twenty bucks at Peckle Park. Yeah, Stop from right here. Twenty dollars. Get your drink on here. Get your drink on here. And if it's a Friday, remember bottomless drinks on Friday. Get your drink on here. Walk your way because you can't drive. Walk your way to Pickle Park and watch the game happen. Ever after. Hold I, up, hold up. But this I told you. What the fuck you say? Hold up, hold up. Look at the camera. 
I told you, try the apple pie. Please, try it. Bitch, the Dirty South eats apple pie for breakfast. It's orgasmic. Organic? <laughs> no. Orgasmic. orgasmic. There's gas in there. With gas? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, maybe it's just once you, once you try, you're gonna fart. It can't be our game. All right, I just drank the devil's piano, and I think I have the devil on my <laughs> on my shoulder. Yeah. Where are you? Oh, there you go. Right here. Huh? Ah, the devil. Oh, okay. Ha. Ah, there's the devil. Uh, All right. Devil. Are you telling me to eat the apple? I'm saying eat yeah. the apple. Definitely fucking eat the apple because it gives you power beyond control. You know how I know the devil's lying? Because he said eat the apple when you're supposed to drink the apple. You know what? You can go fuck yourself. <laughs>